here at Disney's Animal Kingdom today on this glorious day. It seems there's to be a lot of people here, but here with Dan. And uh, we have Guys, the same check shirts our on. Matching shirts out. We're pretty cool, aren't we? And wait. <laughs> and we're with JoJo, <laughs> who also uh. has the same shirt on. <laughs> Time to go to the Animal Kingdom. Yes. Now the last time I was here, I was actually rope dropping. And if you guys take a look at the wait times right now, everything's about 60 minutes. Don't really know if that's because people are here for Valentine's Day. Kind of a little bit early for that since it is Saturday the 30th. Maybe it's just the weekend crowds too. Or maybe this is because you're, it's midday. And uh, I don't really know. What do you guys think? I don't know. I was surprised that so many people were, were here. They want to see all the animals. <laughs> that's why a lot of people are here. <laughs> Definitely walking on in. Way more people than we were here last time when we rope dropped. But again, that's the idea of rope dropping. Skipping all this. We're headed in the direction of the Nomads Lounge right now, which is... Nomads? Nomads. <laughs> we're headed in the direction of the Nomads Lounge right now, which is a really good bar. I heard it's first come, first serve. We're gonna see if they, they have some room. It's right next to Tiffin's if you guys have no idea where it is and right before you head on into Pandora. Coming midday doesn't seem to be the, the way to go, at least today. Look at all those people up there. Wow, didn't really expect this. No Man's Lounge is right here. Looks to be a line. Oh, that's perfect. good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We've got about a 75 minute wait right now. We're just putting down our name. JoJo's giving your number and we'll get a text message when we can come on back. JoJo, are you even vlogging? Yeah. Yeah, I'm vlogging. Hey. <laughs> Super whoopoo. As we're heading on into Pandora, Navi River Journey Line is on the bridge. It's gonna be quite the day. Although it is almost two o'clock too, so that's a good sign that some people might be park hopping, but that's also a bad sign too. Some people might be coming. We keep getting looks at for our shirts because we're all just matching. It's a nice shirt though, I love this shirt. There is a lot of people here today. A lot of people. We're gonna actually get a margarita over here. Do you guys remember when we ate at Baseline Tap House? This is my favorite pretzel right here. It is so good, I'm telling you. Especially the cheese, the cheese is superb. The Moara Margarita, $13, wow, I didn't realize it was that much. Yikes. Thanks again. Let's go, boys. All right, so technically this drink isn't new. I just haven't had it since the update about a year ago. They used to have like the red, I think it was a strawberry margarita. Now it tastes like lime, so that, for it being lime, it's not bad. It's lime, right? It tastes yeah. lime, right? Yeah. It tastes like tequila. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which is good. Honestly, it's not bad. Still prefer the strawberry. Strawberry is my favorite kind of margarita. Jodo's eating at Satuli here, and that was super quick. It was actually really That was really quick. Especially for a mobile how many order. people are here today. Yeah. Uh, this is a very strong statement for me not liking lime margaritas, but I would probably get this again. It's like a hint. It's like a hint of lime, and I don't like a full blast of lime like they are in Mexico. This is good. Try it. It's so, so good. We were told to leave our tray right there, and I believe that's because they're gonna clean it, and so nobody else actually sits there. Keep in mind too, as we're gonna be passing the Lion King show, this summer, the show will be back. Disney did announce that the Lion King, Festival of the Lion King, is coming back. Don't know the exact date, but that is a hint that some other shows might be returning this summer. Flight of Passes also just went down to a 45 minute wait, but I think we're actually gonna go on the safari. We're gonna try to get on one of our friends' safari which is kind of cool. <laughs> this is a weird sign. End of line. Thanks. Okay, got you. Let's go on in. Yeah, there's a lot of people here. I really miss the acrobats that used to perform right here. It was always a cool show. 
right here. Not no more. We're gonna come on back to the safaris or no man's lounge reservation. Just no text us. No man's is. Wait, did I say man's? Yes, no uh, man's. <laughs> no man's lounge. No <laughs> reservation just came up. I got no man's lounge. We have no, no. ten minutes. Ten minutes. Ten, yeah, minutes, ten minutes to report to duty. We can do this. There's actually a line to get inside Gorilla Falls right now. I haven't seen that before. I was wondering what that line was. There's a huge line back there just to go inside Gorilla Falls. It's crazy. Here's the cast members out here greeting and putting you guys in line. Usually you're freely just to walk on in there. The end of line for Navi River Journey has made it all the way over here. Hello. <laughs> Just in time for us to go to Nomad's Lounge. Nomad? Nomad. Nomad's? I got no mans. A quick look at the Nomad's Lounge. It's quieter in here than I thought. We're gonna grab one drink here and then just see what the day takes us. It's very cool in here. This is actually uh, Joe Rohde's one of his favorite spots to come once he comes to Animal Kingdom. If you didn't know that, now you do. We're gonna go with the High Tower Rocks. It loads. <laughs> Mine's about to overflow. dark in here, apologize for that, but this is like a tequila drink right up my alley. Oh, it's right up his alley. Right this is a tequila drink with watermelon. Usually I don't like watermelon in my drinks, but kind of just like what I had in Pandora, it's like a like a kiss of watermelon, not like an overblast of watermelon, and I'm okay with that. And since it has tequila in there, we like tequila here on this channel. We've been here for like a hot second. I think if you guys get food, it does take a little bit longer than the drinks simply because they actually share the same kitchen with Tiffin's. I think it was about, it's been 15 minutes or so, maybe even 20. I'm glad I waited for this thing. Yeah, I mean the food's good. You just, yeah. I think it just is gonna take a little while because their main priority is gonna be Tiffin's. I decided to get the impossible slider because Dan just got this. I haven't had a, a vegan burger in a while. Heard these are good, so we're gonna try it. And I heard the fries are actually amazing. It comes with ketchup as well. Let's give it a give it a bite real quick. That's spicier. Spicier than I remember, honestly. It's good. It has a lot of flavor behind it. But that was actually mm. I wasn't expecting the spice. I'm gonna eat it all though. That's good. Stuff. Still can't believe this is a, not a burger. It's kind of like a grill taste. Is that what you would say? Okay. It tastes kind of like a grill. It does. It literally tastes like a burger. Yeah. I actually think like this is the. Uh, this specific Impossible Burger is the closest I've tasted wow. to like a regular burger. Like this it's one's really juicy good. too. Yeah, right. <laughs> From my past vegan experience, this is like the best vegan burger I think I've ever had. Dan's vegan. Used to be. Used to be. But I think this is the best fake burger I've ever tried. <laughs> Not bad. I'm gonna try this fry now. Normally, the, these fries are actually pretty big. Normally, they kind of have like a freezer taste when they have thick fries. You know? I love these fries. <laughs> Keep in mind too because technically Tiffin's is like a signature dining. That's why this food is actually really, really good. Like these fries are honestly probably the best fries I've actually had on Disney property. They're not bad at all. They're actually really freaking good. Way better than the ones at Casey's Corner obviously. They just have like a really good taste to it and slider. It's good. <laughs> Did you see what I should have We uh, just got out of the Nomad's Lounge. Um, two and a half hours later. Was it are, actually two and a half hours? It was two and a half hours. No way. Two, two hours and 15 minutes. I'm rounding up. So two hours. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. I watch you every day. Thank you. <laughs> Surprisingly, the park is not empty yet. <laughs> That was my prediction that it was gonna be empty. <laughs> but there, there's still people here. We were literally in there forever. I did want to update you guys on one thing here. If you guys come with a party of 10 people, Disney actually just updated their social distancing with parties of 10. So if you're with parties of 10, they're gonna ask you to split into parties of two parties of five. That's a little update with the social distancing rules here at Disney World. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, weird, right? Did not know that. I think that's like, if you go into, Lines, it's kind of weird. Oh, 
Yeah, because I guess it's probably hard to keep their six feet markers with yeah, 10 with people. Ten people. On one, right? Makes sense. <laughs> oh, and they also have one more update too. You can actually now wear uh, clear face masks. Don't know why you want to do that, but you can do that now. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to look really weird. If you want to do that, go for it. It's time to go on Everest. Here we go. 20 minute wait. Wait, I stumbled upon the coolest photo pass shot ever. It's so cool. Stay tuned, watch this. We're gonna go over here and I'll show you the picture after. So this photo shoots from way over there to here. It's like a max zoom shot. It's really, really cool. Here it is. That took all of two seconds. Do you guys like that shot? It's like a super zoom photo pass shot. Thank you. Oh no, it shut down. Ah, uh, they're dumping the queue. Something broke down. What great luck we have today. Dan, how happy that you that we just waited 20 minutes for the line to be dumped? Oh, uh, well you know what man? At the end of the day, at least we're alive and healthy. <laughs> <laughs> This has actually never happened to me before. Ooh. And out we go. Actually, it's kind of funny too. This is like the first time I feel like I've ever experienced a ride dump here at Disney World. Very rare. And I vlog every day. And on that note, this vlog is going to be coming to an end. Thank you guys for the support each and every single day. Kind of bad luck here at the end of the day. But uh, crowds are back at Disney World, at least Animal Kingdom for the weekend. Don't really know, probably gonna have to test this out, see how Rope Drop is in the next coming month. Cause uh, I'm gonna be doing that every single month. But uh, yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Where'd Jojo go? Oh. Hello. Okay. And every day is, oh, wrong, wrong <laughs> vlog, wrong vlog. Okay, <laughs> see you guys. <laughs>